news story that we've been following since our newscast at 6 o'clock. New details about the security concern that caused a flight from Houston to Amsterdam to be grounded. Here is what we know so far. Houston police and FBI agents responded to reports of two men arguing on board that plane. The 269 passengers on board were escorted off the plane while it was still on the tarmac. And as of right now, no arrests have been made. Tonight, we have live team coverage for you. We will have more on the investigation in just a moment. But we'll begin with Jennifer Bauer, who spoke to passengers. Jen? Well, 269 passengers who have really been at this airport all day because this flight was supposed to take off this afternoon at 3.30. Some of those passengers are still in line here behind me. Right now, they are trying to get rebooked on other flights. They're also getting hotel vouchers for the night. I can tell you this line is significantly shorter than it was just an hour ago. This man doesn't want to show his face on camera, but he was sitting right by the two passengers who were taken off KLM flight 8412 because of a security concern. He explained what happened. Uh, two Arabic men were sitting next to each other. They were arguing in Arabic. Uh, a lady was sitting next to, next to them. She got really suspicious of that, and she called the flight attendants. Passengers say the plane stopped taxiing, and the captain came on the intercom and made an announcement. We were told there was a security issue, and then we were told that the police were going to embark. The captain said that uh, two people have been misbehaving. Passengers started snapping photos, and one even took some cell phone video. It shows the Houston police officers on board taking two passengers off the plane. It didn't say anything. Uh, they didn't put up any resistance. Uh, they were handcuffed and just walked off the plane. The passengers were stuck on the plane for quite a while and eventually bussed back to the terminal. Now, 269 people are trying to rebook new flights and find hotels for the night. They've been here at the airport since early this afternoon. Now, some of the passengers on board this flight live here in Houston now, but they are from Europe originally, and they told me they were just trying to get home for the holidays. The bad news is a lot of these people are being told the earliest they are going to be able to get on new flights is Friday afternoon because, again, it's just 269 passengers. There's just not that many flights for that many people heading overseas, and so it is going to take them a while to get everybody where they want to go. Uh, also, there were a lot of families with children on board this flight. We talked to a couple passengers who said, a lot of very anxious, very worried moms and dads because you have to keep in mind uh, the captain just came over the intercom and said there was a security concern, but they were not given specifics in the beginning, and so they didn't really know what was going on. A lot of very anxious and scared parents with a lot of kids on board who are just now relieved to be on safe ground and headed home or to a hotel for the night, and then again they will be trying to get back out as early as Friday. For now, though, we are live inside Bush Airport. I'm Jennifer Bauer, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Thank you, Jen.